Hey everybody, I'm Zach, this is Shmurkadabur, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. Today's daily is the silent Chimera. Interesting. Certain future horrible and Midas. Wow. <clears throat> this is, uh, this is an interesting one. So, I like Chimera a lot. I think it's a very cool setup. Um, but we don't have a whole lot of choice in how we do this, so... I think a bash... And I think a zap here is probably the best choice. Um, okay. Give me... Alright, one defend. And I think we go with another bash here. Just keep him vulnerable. Um, we got survivor, which is amazing. And then I think we go strike defend here. This is an awkward fight. Um, two strikes, please. Thank you. Alright. Dodge and roll, outmaneuver, expertise. We're gonna go with dodge and roll here. Yes, we will upgrade a strike and a defend. Horrible. And, um... I think we want to get rid of... How many defends do we have? One, two, three versus three strikes. Let's remove a strike. And hopefully we can get an attack or two here. Um, we're gonna do something like this. Alright. This is, a again, just an awkward, awkward fight. Um, Chimera is making things a little strange for us here, but... We'll be alright. I think a bash and a strike plus. Very good. Finisher. Not exactly what we want. I think we go with Quick Slash. We're hoping to get some upgrades here. Mm, didn't really want to draw Zap there, but that's okay. It's a very small deck. Um, we're gonna go with a Zap and a Strike Plus. Get that passive damage roll in here. This sucks. Oof. I don't like this guy. Uh, defend Plus and Defend are great. Thanks to dodge and roll, we've got some nice stuff going here. Strike does more damage than a zap here. And we're looking for damage. There we go. Dagger spray. Absolutely. Hmm. I think we go for it. Alright, we're definitely going to use our block potion here. This is a dangerous fight. Um, I love the defend plus, and the, I should have waited for zap. We're gonna go like this, best damage, and then we'll use our block potion here. Get him with another bash. Alright, give me lots of attacks please. Oh, thank you. That was outstanding. Now, we're in a lot of danger. Still. I think we go zap here for extra damage. We're taking 11. 16 to go. Um, I'm gonna go with a quick slash and then a survivor and a dodge and roll. Take 8 damage. We only need one attack this turn and we got it. Lagavulin causing problems, but we did pick up frozen egg and we're gonna take backflip. Uh, we have to rest because we have Midas, which is a huge problem. We get no upgrades either. This is a horrible, horrible daily. Um, we're gonna go Zap and Quick Slash here. Bummer to draw our Strike Plus. Maybe should have used an Energy Potion there. No big deal. We could take zero, and I think we should take zero. All right, we'll let Zap do a little bit of work here. I hate being weak, but we are no longer weak. That's nice. So you're doing nine. Let's get Survivor out there, plus dodge and roll, and then we'll hit you with a quick slash. We'd love to finish you off here. Zap is not being helpful right now, but we do have a kill. I think... I think we do this? Yeah, alright. 
Again, awkward, but we took no damage, so that's good. We have a Wraith Form Plus. Ooh, that is tempting. Um, but I don't think it's what we want. I think... Sucker Punch is real nice. We're coming up to a shop. Wraith Form is really interesting. Especially if we can get um, an artifact through Panacea or... I'm going to take Wraith Form. It's just a very good card. Alright, we're at very high health, and this shop is going to get us something really good. I can I can feel it. Um, Well-Aid Plans is great. Um, Panache being pre-upgraded is pretty nice. We don't have any zero-cost cards, really, so we're not going to make it work very often. We could also double a card. We could get a second Wraith Form. Uh, which is not bad at all. But I think... Who's our boss? I think we pass on the rest of this. And, uh, and just hope for something good. Let's... Let's get our block going here. <clears throat> I'd love to get, like, a finesse. Would be super helpful. Um, let's go with the strike plus here. We want to finish this guy off as soon as possible, but take as little damage as possible as well. Well laid plans is great. Look at all these blocks, dude. This is silly. We did get letter opener though, which is nice. Don't forget that we have that. Um, okay. Very, very good. I think another backflip is great. Now, we're still looking for ways to deal damage. Um... Which is unfortunate. Let's get Zap going here. It also gets Letter Opener. And we can retain both of these cards. So... a oh, horrible split. But we did keep Dagger Spray, so that helps. Um, Dagger Spray here. We're gonna backflip. And we're gonna dodge and roll. And we're gonna retain Wraith Form. And defend plus, I think. Uh, if both of them attack, <clears throat> it's a problem. We're also frail. This is rough. Um, but we only need one defend here, so we can get this strike out and this quick slash out. And we can retain these. I think that this is going to be a very low scoring daily. <laughs> Um, alright, let's get a kill, and then a backflip, and a dodge and roll. Get us three free, three free Brocks next turn. I'm gonna keep Bash and Zap and hope he doesn't attack. He does not, that's fantastic. Getcha, getcha. Definitely gonna take Slice, we need some zero cost stuff as well as attacks because we've got some card draw so um let's start with this here um we're also going to dodge and roll and quick slash we picked up slice with it that's awesome so slice is going to be super helpful over the course of this run uh one more defend getting well laid plans is helpful too let's get that out there What are you watching? <laughs> That's so funny. This dude got his sister an MP3 player, and he's singing all the songs that he's putting on it for. <laughs> it's so funny. All right. It's the best. This fight went pretty well. Took zero damage. And Blade Dance, Sucker Punch, Riddle, Riddle with Holes. I really like Blade Dance here. Um, and the reason for that is that it activates Letter Opener while also giving us damage. So it allows us to do Letter Opener um, without... Let's get a Bash going here. Uh, it allows us to get Letter Opener without having to play blocks, which is super helpful. Um, we're gonna retain these two attacks, so we can pretty much guarantee getting a split here. 
Slice is awesome. Get Dagger Spray going. And then a dodge and roll for defense next turn is a pretty nice setup. Um, I don't... I don't love our chances to take zero damage in this fight. Uh, we're gonna get Zap going for sure. It also gets Letter Opener out there. And we're gonna need all the blocks that we can get for next turn. Because he's gonna do 16 damage. Very nice. Now, we cannot slice and not take damage, so we'll pass, but we'll retain slice. He's gonna attack for 20 next turn. Um, give me the dodge and roll. All right. Mm, I like the idea of Masterful Stab, but I don't like it in practice. Um, Grand Finale might just work out for us here. Uh, it's, it's crazy, I, I have to admit. <laughs> Um, but we can retain it, so let's retain it. He's definitely not going to attack next turn, so we'll keep the strike. And, um, the bash and strike plus is a huge pickup there. Now, we need to get ourselves set up to make Grand Finale work. Uh, which means we need to backflip twice. We m we're not gonna play Grand Finale this turn. Um, keep a keep a dagger spray. Probably should have kept the zap too, actually, but he's vulnerable, so the dagger spray should be enough. Um, go with that. Split, and then if we don't do any card draw, um, let's go ahead and try this out. Uh, if we don't do any card draw, then we should be able to make grand finale work. Yeah, this is pretty nice. Keep Survivor, keep Wraith Form. Um, now, we're going to draw Grand Finale, but we're probably not going to be able to use it. Unless we do something like this. Love it. Um, we can do this. All right, feeling pretty good. He's gonna do four damage next turn. And we've already got four block. All right. Things are working out right now. We just want damage. We gotcha. It's gonna be close. We did it. <laughs> That's a perfect, a scary perfect, but a perfect nonetheless. And um, I think an upgraded in Venom is pretty nice for us. We need some way to deal more damage. Um, I hate Velvet Choker. We really want the energy, but I don't think we can make Velvet Choker work for us. Uh, so we're going to go White Beast Statue. Hopefully we'll get some energy potions to, uh, to help push us through this. But that's one perfect on a boss, and that's more than I expected to get in this. Yes, get it. Well, in Venom is not ideal, actually, <laughs> on this guy. But whatever. We'll take it. Um, give me a backflip. Give me a defend. Get five damage out there. Okay. Ugly turn. We're going to take a hit for 14. Uh, we'd love to get a little bit of healing. We just got to go for damage right now. Um, we might use Wraith Form next turn. In fact, we probably will use Wraith Form next turn. Yeah, let's do it. Can't be taking this kind of damage. All right, and since we're only taking small hits here, we'll uh, retain our damage dealers. 
Get a couple of points of poison on there. We're taking one point of damage. He is getting block, which is unfortunate. But we have one more turn of Wraith Form left. We have to do 19 damage. Um, shouldn't be too tough. And in fact, we can even get enough block. He's dead anyway. All right. Crippling Cloud. I like the idea. We don't discard enough cards probably to make Sneaky Strike work. So I'm going to take Crippling Cloud here. We got letter opener there, which means we got a little bit of damage. So that's solid, but this guy is a problem. Um, all right, we can prevent all this damage. We're going to dump Crippling Cloud and play in Venom here. All right. I think this is worth it to take one point of damage. We break a piece of armor here. Get to keep some cards. Got a little poison in there for an additional point of damage. Um, okay, 12, huh? Alright. Definitely keep Slice and keep Strike Plus. This should allow us to break through his armor next turn. Hopefully it won't do too big of a hit. It's 12. All right, this is excellent. Can break two pieces of armor there and add some nice poison um, for next turn. We're getting very close to being able to break through his armor, but I'd still like to take zero damage here. We're gonna play Dagger Spray because um, it allows the uh, the lightning orb to deal a little bit of damage. Again, allows that lightning orb to do a little bit of damage. Um, man, not having four energy is a huge problem. And I'm starting to think we maybe should have taken Velvet Choker. We also can use potions because we have White Beast Statue. We shouldn't forget about that as well. All right. He's got eight plated armor remaining. <laughs> um, we're going to play this defend here too. Continue to take zero damage. Frailty is a problem, but we can get around it a little bit. Uh, backflip. Backflip. Defend, I suppose. We'll hang on to Slice. And Defend. Because we're not going to be frail next turn, so these Defends are going to be worth a little bit more. But we're really struggling to break through his block. This turn, however... We get to do it. All right. Taking zero. Continuing to take zero, I should say. And now our strike plus can break through its block by itself. Can we get a kill? I believe that we can. But not if we accidentally do that. No, we're okay. All right. I'm going to take accuracy. It's upgraded. We do have a few shivs. Gonna drink this regen potion right now. Um, yeah, yeah, that'll be helpful. Hopefully, the Sneko Eye will let us play Crippling Cloud. We've got a free Wraith form, which is pretty huge. All right. We'll retain this, and that is all, because we're never gonna play those for three cost. Love the free Crippling Cloud. Yeah, yeah, this turn works. Um, again, we're not going to hang on to any of that because it's just too expensive. We take a hit for one damage, not a big deal.
I'm gonna go dagger spray here because it adds two poison instead of just one. All right, I think it's time for wraith form. And then we'll get you with a bash, quick slash. We don't want to hang on to any of those. The poison plus whatever attack damage we get should be able to finish him off. Blech, ugly. Ugly. Um, give me three cards, please. We got nothing worthwhile. We will hang on to the two cost blade dance, which probably gets a kill next turn. Yes, it certainly does. All right, a good fight. We got a lot of HP back there. And I think Piercing Whale Plus is good. This guy is a problem. Got Accuracy out there, which means Blade Dance is great. And that's pretty good turn one damage. All right, 21. Dude, I hate that he makes us frail. That's horrible. We are not taking a hit, but we had to use all of our potions to make it happen. Piercing Whale well will be a, a huge help on one of these turns. Um, okay, so let's hit him with that. And then we continue with the bash here. We're going to keep Wraith Form and Slice because we're almost certainly going to play Wraith Form next turn. Yeah. All right, I think we got him, um, but it was not easy. <laughs> it was definitely not easy. All right, a good fight still though, and we're taking bullet time. Um, we're not gonna become vampires, and this elite is gonna be real scary, but bullet time is gonna help us out a lot, as you can see here. Now, I wish we had a draw potion. Um, we can retain two cards here. And I think we want to do that to make bullet time a little better. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to slice you. Zap, defend, dagger spray. And then end our turn here, keep these, take a massively ridiculous amount of damage, and then, then we're good. Um, then we bullet time. Twelve, nineteen, twenty-seven damage. I'm not ready for Wraith form yet, so we're gonna do it like that. If only the Zap had gotten the kill there, but we're only taking four damage here. It's not a huge deal. Um, Piercing Whale is amazing. And then we can Crippling Cloud. It gets a kill that we're very happy with. Keep Blade Dance, please. Piercing Whale was so good there. <laughs> okay, you're doing 10. Now we can start we can start making some good stuff happen here. Um, let's get in Venom out there, and then we're gonna retain bullet time and quick slash. Yeah. We just want to get damage out there at this point. We have in Venom, so that's gonna help out a lot with the damage, and these guys shouldn't do too too much. All right. Very good. Uh, this fight... This fight went okay. <laughs> Amazingly. Um, Could have gone a lot, lot worse. The boot is horrible. Adrenaline is so helpful. We have so much money. If we can make it to this shop, it might save us. Um, 21. Yeah, we don't need to play Piercing Whale here. Well, 
Good stuff. We got a uh, letter opener twice that turn, which is really great. Ooh, I love this. Okay. Dealing some good damage here. If they don't both attack, um, then we're in pretty good shape. I think we go Crippling Cloud here. It, it prevents the same amount of damage as the Defend does. So, um, yeah. Courier is going to be great because of the restock. We're going to get some really nice stuff out of this shop. Okay, it's slow going, but the poison is really working on this guy. We're doing well. Uh, poison wise here all right you're dead um sure we'll get a zap nice it hit the right person and we'll keep the backflips okay 34 damage huh well we me play accuracy quick slash strike keep bullet time and let's keep Wraith Form, because we'll get him in three turns for certain. So if he attacks, we can just pop Wraith Form with Bullet Time here. And Invenom is doing amazing work. Okay, we gotcha. Solid. And another Blade Dance is in order, I think. All right. I mean, this is good. That was an amazing turn for Piercing Whale. Uh, because although we became vulnerable, it didn't affect us at all. Alright, we're going to take a hit for six. No big deal. Got a little bit of poison going. I love it. We are no longer vulnerable. That's huge. And, um... Accuracy is going to do a number on this fool next turn. It's going to do an incredible number on this fool next turn. Oh, baby. All right. Yeah, that was just a fantastic turn. Definitely want to get Zap going when we can here. And retaining Wraith Form has been super, super helpful. I'll take it. One point of damage. Again, no big deal. Um... All right, good stuff. We can get bullet time going, finally. Uh, let's get our blade dances out there. We're going to take a hit for four here. Um, unless we kill him, which we did. Amazing. Backfit plus outmaneuver is pretty nice with bullet time. Concentrate's not bad with the backflips if we can get it upgraded. Um, but I think outmaneuver is really nice for us. No fight. Thank you. We will take a curse for Runic Dodecahedron. Come on now. All right. We definitely want footwork. Um, we want to deflect. We want to remove Writhe. Uh, we'll take Ninja Scroll. We'll take Sneko Skull and Tori. Um, I think Ornamental Fan is really nice for us. And uh, I think that's it. Mayhem is pretty solid let's do it that basically counts as extra energy we spent all of our money and now we've got a good chance here i think this is a tough daily this is a tough one uh we got footwork on turn one we will definitely take out maneuver Very good. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, now we're talking. Now we're, we're starting to dish out some damage. We're taking a hit, and there's nothing we could do about it, but... Um, I think we've got a nice chance in this fight, especially if we can get Wraith Form back. Love it. Taking zero, we're dishing out a lot of poison, which is great, thanks to Sneko Skull plus Venom. Uh, free backflips, amazing. Um, here's what we do. We're gonna Blade Dance, get you, and get you again. Then we can Piercing Whale here. You're dead. We're taking zero damage, so we can play out Maneuver. That's awesome. Um, keep a backflip and a strike plus, please. We got bullet time back, which is going to be amazing for this turn because we can backflip and quick slash into it. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. All right. Um, crippling cloud, of course. And we get to retain Wraith form for his big turn. I think we got this. I think we're good. You're doing 38 damage, huh? Yeah, we're, we're gonna go Wraith form here. Um, Dagger Spray and Strike. We're gonna keep them because Aura Calcum makes sure we take zero damage when we are intangible. So we just want to dish out as much poison as we can at this point. So, Dagger Spray, Blade Dance, Strike Plus, we got him. He's already dead. This is great. That was a great fight. We took a hit that I would rather not have taken, uh, but that bullet time outmaneuver combo as well is what we're really looking for here. Um, we're going to dump the explosive for Swift. And I think a second Wraith Form is exactly the kind of thing we need. Cursed Key is going to be perfect for us. We finally got some energy, and uh, we're on track to, to win here. This is good. This is good. That second floor was a struggle, but um, super worth it. You're doing 15. Well, we can prevent that. Play Mayhem, play Blade Dance, and with accuracy... We're doing massive amounts of damage here. And now, Outmaneuver is going to come in handy. We also can now play a backflip and, um, and a uh, bullet time, which is huge. We didn't need to that round, but we're happy to be able to. Dagger throw, poison stab, sneaky strike. I like poison stab. Because we get one extra poison added. Um, and with Venom, we get two extra poison added. But, I don't know if we really want it. Um, dagger throw is pretty good, and maybe we should take dagger throw since we have cursed key. Great first turn there. Got our shivs going. Um, accuracy is super helpful here. Guess we just go with the slice. Bad turn. Could have drawn maybe, but they just keep building themselves up here, which is fine. I'm okay with this. Um, yeah. Especially with... Uh, oh, we have Runic going, too, of course. Um, Alright, you're done. You're already dead. So, we actually don't want Mayhem here. All right, and we can play Wraith Form and finish this fight off, I think. Um, let's do it.
Good fight. Who's our boss? Donu Deka. So I think escape plan is really good. Pre-upgraded. Wow. We got no block whatsoever. We did get Piercing Whale, but I think we want to save it. I think we... Um... There we go. And now we don't even need... Um... We actually killed that guy. I can't believe it. We don't even need to use one of our potions. All right. Escape plan didn't do us any good. But backflip plus crippling cloud plus deflect means we get enough block. Let's play outmaneuver and zap. And uh, this deck is looking pretty good. This deck is looking like it's going to work crazily. I, I didn't think it would at the beginning of this, but we'll take it. I love getting Dagger Spray here. Um, could play two more skills. Could play Bullet Time Defend and we deal five damage, but there's gonna be a turn where they're all attack and it's, they all attack and it's gonna be real bad. And that's why we're saving Piercing Whale here. All right. Should have gotten Venom going earlier. You're doing 22 damage. We can easily prevent that. Very nice. That footwork is the best pickup we've had so far for this run. All right, here we go. This is what Piercing Whale is for. All right. Oh, I love it. We've actually, uh, we're golden here. Keep the strike in the bullet time, and uh, the zap is gonna finish off whoever's left, of course. All right. And we've got Wraith form. <laughs> um, good stuff. Now we bullet time and you're dead. Great fight, man. We're not taking any damage here, which is incredible to me. Um, distraction, acrobatics. Let's go acrobatics. We seem to have enough energy to make that work. Dude, getting accuracy on turn one every time has been extraordinary. And, uh, oh. All right. Yeah, that was an outstanding first turn. Couldn't ask for better there. Getting accuracy on turn one has been incredible for us. Um, let's draw some cards. We'll dump Wraith for him. We don't need it. Kill you and kill you. I think another backflip is in order. <laughs> that extra card draw with bullet time is so good. Um... We could get money and get two normalities. Could also just fight a boss for a relic. Upgrading all cards, also pretty good, but I think there's a good chance we take damage if we do that, and that's real scary. Um, especially since we have to fight an elite. I think we probably just want to fight a boss. We've got a good amount of money, although with the courier, that might be a mistake. All right, turn one in Venom, amazing. Um, keep the damage coming. Oh, yes. Uh, what don't we need? I don't think we need this defend. Um, 
I love this. And that poison is going to add so much damage. All right. Well, only one is attacking. What did we just play? Survivor. Fair enough. Um, we don't need this strike. Get footwork, dodge and roll, backflip out there. Definitely... We could split you, probably. Yeah. But I think we outmaneuver and zap. And then we hang on to these. Um, Crippling Cloud is so good. Huge. Alright, easy fight. And we got the Nunchaku. I don't mind it. Noxious Fumes. Didn't even have to think about it. Okay. Unnecessary rest, but... Wow. We're getting good turns right now. We have enough energy to play everything, so we can actually hang on to bullet time, which is awesome. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Yes. And we'll save Piercing Whale. I like it. Bullet Time is going to do some nice work here. I can feel it. And Venom is great. Uh, we got to Acrobatics. Good stuff. At some point, this guy, well, this lady, I should say, yeah, she's going to do a super strong attack. That's what we want Piercing Whale for. Um, you're already dead. And, yes, we do need to Piercing Whale. It's fine. And we'll retain two Wraith Forms, I suppose. Um, now, if we just were to play both of these, we'd probably be pretty happy. Great turn. Let's get Mayhem going. Retain both of these. Probably could have just retained one. But, oh well, yeah, we're probably going to play it this turn. Um, acrobatics is what we just drew. Go ahead and dump... Survivor, because we're going to play a Wraith Form. Blade Dance is probably our best bet. We'll play another Wraith Form next turn. We'll lose two decks per turn, but five in tangibility, I don't think we have a problem with it. Yeah, you're already dead. Good fight. Okay. Good stuff, man. Bottled Flame, choose an attack to start with. And Nightmare, we definitely want. Um, I'm going to dump this for a second Ancient Potion. We can really, really, really make Wraith Form work with that. Uh, what do we want on turn one? I think a Quick Slash. And we'll definitely fight. Wraith Form is going to be huge in this fight. Um, let's go ahead and start with, uh, well, let's start with accuracy. Gonna get some block for that. Love bullet time, man. We're not gonna get it. So let's discard Nightmare. Um, 
I think we do play Piercing Whale here. We get Mayhem, Noxious, and Envenom going. All right. We need a Wraith form as soon as possible. We got a free bullet time, which means we can't draw cards, which is a huge problem. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, we're taking 32 damage here. It's okay. We'll get rests. Um, we got a free backflip. I like it. Definitely play Wraith form here. All right. We'll be okay. We just needed Wraith form. Once we got Wraith form, we were good. Go ahead and play the other one, too. All right, he's dead. Ugly fight, but we'll take it. We don't want any of that. We picked up normality, which stinks, but here's a shop. Ooh, baby. We don't have any more elites, so this is pointless. I think potion belt is excellent. Um, I think gambling chip is excellent. Panacea, also good. Infinite Blades is great. Mind Blast is great. Um, we have another shop coming, right? So, Bag of Prep. Uh, let's remove Normality. And then I'm going to take Bag of Prep, too. All right. Happy with how this is going. Um, what don't we want here? We kind of like all of it, actually. So, start with well-laid plans. Um, 31 damage Mind Blast is great. And then... Very nice. Play a Blade Dance to get you. We got Nunchaku. I love it. So we'll take Infinite Blades and Mayhem. Alright, what's getting played? Bash for free, I love it. Um, play Wraith Form. Should have played in Venom first, no big deal. All right. So when we get our second Wraith Form, this fight is over, and there it is. Uh, okay. I'm gonna start with the backflip. Mm, was hoping for, um. Gotcha. Was hoping for... What was I hoping for? I have no idea. <laughs> bullet time, maybe? I don't know. There's bullet time, speaking of which. Choose a card to copy. Choose a card to copy? What the heck did I play that allows me to copy a card? Um... Oh, it's Nightmare. It's Nightmare. Just give me the shivs. All right. He dead. Good stuff. Go ahead and play it. Why not? All right. A third Ancient Potion. A Terror is great, especially a free Terror. Getting some HP back, I love it. And we can spend a little more money on a shop. We can start with a power every single time with Bottled Tornado. Um, and we want to start with Accuracy, I think. Now, let's start with Invenom. And then anything else that we want. I think another Acrobatics is fine. We could also remove a card. And that card removal will be this regular strike. All right. Proceed. Give me that last, uh... I mean, this is great. We can dump Piercing Whale. Would have loved to have gotten Panacea. We're going to go ahead and use this to make this fight easier. Maybe made a mistake by not playing Mind Blast here, but you know what? 
I don't even mind. <laughs> Get it? I love it. I love it. All right. This is what I was hoping for. Do we have any card draw? No, we don't. So let's bullet time. Mayhem, blade dance, dodge and roll, defend, shiv, 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 mind blast. Um, and I'd rather take zero damage here. Let's go ahead and play Wraith form. I think we've got this fight under control. Yeah, he's already dead. Great fight. Okay. That kills a little faster than I expected. Um, a flying knee for extra energy? No. A second deflect, though, is great. And we're going to come into this final fight with full HP. We've got double ancient potions. Um, what don't we want here? We'd like to keep Wraith Form, I think. And we'd like to play Wraith Form, for that matter. Um... We're not going to play Mind Blast. Okay, I love this. Uh, Alright, so we have this artifact here, which means Wraith Form is not going to affect our dexterity. So we can go ahead and play that. We'll get Venom going and start Shivs, working on Donu over here, get all the block we need. Noxious gets going. I think we play... I think we play Footwork rather than Infinite Blades here. Um, controversial, I know. <laughs> but with the Shivs, while the Shivs add poison, um, we don't need to play bullet time here. Uh, I think we can draw some cards. Get Mayhem and Outmaneuver going. We still have an artifact. I think all these guys do is add dazes. So, um, what do we discard? Defend. All right. Give me terror here. Accuracy. Definitely will nightmare uh, wraith form. And uh, we've done it. This is over. We're going to get three wraith forms next turn. We'll play one of them. Along with Panacea, that's so good. And uh, we can hang on to the other two. Alright, this is awesome. Poison is stacking, thanks to Noxious. We got our infinite blades out, that's huge. Slice ya. Very, very good. Okay. He is dead next turn. We still have one artifact for our Wraith form. You're already dead. Uh, let's go ahead and play one of these. Very, very good. All right, we got it. This is going to be a perfect as well. So we're going to have perfect two perfected two bosses, which is pretty sweet. Okay. We still have three turns of intangibility left. He's already dead. That nightmare wraith form combo is so good. All right, easy every time. Okay, good run. This is a fun and difficult daily. 878 is all we scored, and that's with two perfects. <laughs> that's with two perfects, that's crazy. So I think 878 is actually gonna be a solid score here. Two twenty-eight, and it looks like that's what everybody got. I think if we had taken Velvet Choker, we might have been able to get one more perfect, but that's all right. 
Um, not a huge deal. So that'll be it for today's episode of Slay the Spire. Thank you so much for tuning in. You know I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you later. I'll see you around. I'll see you next time. Can't wait to play more Slay the Spire. And I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day. Bye.